it's always very important to get low to find them. 90% of the time I shoot bald. It creates like a niche for me. Not a lot of people do it. And uh, it's easier to create conversations with people because there's so many drone photographers out there. There's so many people shooting birds, but not too many people shooting bugs because people probably scared of it. People don't pay attention to it because they're so tiny. People forget about that word. So shooting bugs, I enjoy it more. And it's fascinating to see small things act like us. Everybody was asking, how do you get so close? And I always told them that I started shooting in the afternoon and it was ridiculously difficult to get close to insect. So with time, I was able to study their habit and I knew that between, um, from 10.30 p.m., because we have longer daylight in Canada, those guys are trying to find somewhere to rest for the night. So that's the best time to shoot them. You need to understand your subject. So I had to do a lot of biology study to know the best time to shoot them, how to shoot them. Then I have to be very, very careful in my lighting. That's why I have this flashlight and a diffuser. This is meant to diffuse the light and make it softer so that when you shoot, you can encompass the whole specimen and the lighting is well diffused. Of course, everybody was like, what's a black person doing in nature photography? Because uh, it's, 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 it's the truth. Uh, most people like me, don't do this type of photography because we just do portrait, travel, maybe a few in landscape. I know just a handful in the US doing birding. In macro worldwide, I've only seen four black guys. I just don't want people to judge the book by its cover because we can also enjoy nature. I'm not shooting people. I'm not gonna spoil my brand. My brand is insects. It's like my own lane. I won't go to another lane that is congested already when I have my lane. During winter, when I can't shoot insects, I, I tend to get a bit depressed. Yeah, so when, when it's summertime, I take all the time I can. People said, don't you sleep? I was like, I'll sleep during winter. Like, <laughs> basically I will, like the beer, I'll sleep during winter. Now I need to shoot as many bugs as I can. I got a comment today, I don't know how you do it, but what you do is fantastic. So I, I put in the time, I put in the energy. So when people say that, I just smile. But it makes me feel good. I have a photo that went viral last year or two years ago. That's a shot of a long horn beetle. And long horn beetles in China are massive. So I shot it in the morning, so he had dew on his face. So most people say says it looks like um, Terminator or it looks like uh, Darth Vader. But my own personal favorite shot is still the shot of a damsel fly. It's a green damsel fly with a green background. I had the backdrop of leaves when I was shooting it in China, so it's so beautiful. And that picture has gotten so many nominations. I think people are fascinated about the way the damsel was posing, because it was literally posing. It was looking into my lens, fully concentrated, wasn't looking elsewhere.